a long day, long morning. With the walk in the woods yesterday, it definitely took me out. Oh, kids don't eat anything. I'm right back out again. So, I got a late start on the sunny side of life, or CD side of life video. I can't even remember what my own video is called. Awesome. <clears throat> But I figured I would record some more stuff so you could not have all the wind definitely digging the hair. I, I, I certainly had to show that off. One of my good friends did that for me. She has a salon in her home. So I didn't have to go to anywhere that might have a whole lot of people. And finally did something bold. and I, I really like it. I hope everybody else does too. I need to stop looking at myself in the camera and look at you guys. Just a bunch of randomness. This is our nice little cutter system to drain off the water that I was talking about last week. And so it's, as you can see, leveled just enough so it should drain everything off the end. Hey everyone. I switched to my phone, so maybe the focus will be a little bit better. I didn't talk about these, uh, the three in the colored uh, pots here. These were given to me by a friend. She just threw some seeds in a pot and said, here you go. It might be this, 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 or this. Looks like I've got onions, a little, at least green onions, and, and the majority of them. But again, I could still have other things pop up in there. And that is seems to like this soil better than the last stuff I had it in. I had uh, planted this butter crunch in the old um, soil as well. But the other ones, between getting washed out with the gutter situation, just having some super dry soil just didn't want to continue to grow. And so the ones that made it, which were these two, transplanted into these little pots so I could redo the soil mix there. And it looks like it's enjoying it a lot. My jade pole being here. Look at how gorgeous. Just beautiful. I do love this leaf right here, because as you can see, it's a double leaf. See how it's grown over like that? There's my pole bean. That has shot up over the last day or two. It's very exciting. And it looks like I might have some fruit setting on this jalapeno, but again, I got new flowers, so that's, they're still, they're producing flowers, that's the important part. And not too much insane growth on the tomatoes, but they haven't died back any. I did also just put water in here to make sure it did drain. It wasn't too heavy in the center. I did have to readjust a few of the rocks, but for the most part, I mean, it's not holding water, which is what I was worried about. Here's the beautiful yellow onions again. They're tiny, tiny little green onions. They're doing well. I, uh, Instead of thinning out these herbs, I just transplanted the, the uh, ones that had more than one grown next to each other into just a bit of a separation. I just went ahead and put brand new seeds in here since nothing was popping up, so I've got to wait a few more days on that. Again, I got, I think, one parsley popping up, so I replanted the parsley. It's like, oh been pretty fast. Let's keep going. I did the same thing transplanting the extras into uh, a little farther apart from each other so even if they don't all stay or grow or have room. I still tried. And I got the beautiful radishes here. I'm going to the sun for you. Love them, but watching the water glisten for those leaves. These are the French breakfast radishes. I 
they'll do just, just fine. There we go, there's our garden update. Nothing too drastic has changed, but it's been only a week since I transplanted these. So I'm not expecting a huge amount of change. As long as I see some change, that's, that's all we need. Thank you guys for listening. I do appreciate it. I'm liking this beautiful one right there. Gorgeous. Anyways, have a happy day. Thanks for watching the CD Side of Life. Bye-bye.